So do you want to have a boyfriend? All her friends have a boyfriend, but your crush has a girlfriend, so... Hi guys! Hi my people! Hey! Hi guys! Hi everyone! Welcome back again! Back, back again to my channel! Thank you guys for clicking on this video! My name is Ella Sutibo. Subscribe if you haven't. Like, comment, and share your thoughts about this video in the comment section. So let's dive into the reason for today's video. I'm going to talk about our sister, Lily Peters, and then the daughter, also Josh James. So we know Lily Peters, this is not the first time, neither is it the second time I'm talking about them. So something happened. A video was uploaded. Whereby, I think the title was something, let me just give the title for now. So that video was about Lily Peters telling the audience that the daughter, the 11 year, has she completed 11 years? Okay, I think she has completed 11 years. The 11 years old daughter had a heartbreak, first heartbreak from her crush or her boyfriend. <laughs> so, she made that video. And even in that video, she was asking, you know, the daughter, how do you feel that now he has another girlfriend? The daughter was expressing herself, you know? That kind of conversation and i know they stay in america this is america where <laughs> you know there's so many fans so people can identify themselves as cats so people can identify themselves as lesbian you know is a uh, you know the word what it is right now so in the comment section so people feel or some of the subscribers feel that 11 year old is not supposed to even be talking about a boyfriend talkless talking about having a heartbreak because she just realized that the boy has another boyfriend i mean has another girlfriend or the boy does not love her or the boy you know is not seeing her or no more seeing her as attractive or the boy does not fancy her anymore you understand meanwhile other feel that okay is a normal conversation to have but why film it you understand why do you have to film it some other people advise that why is her daughter friends you know why are they pressuring her to have a boyfriend because she has a boyfriend? Guys, we are talking about 11 years. 11 years still a teenage, right? So, I know the world is come to an end. <laughs> we are talking about 11 years old, a teenager. And this is the first daughter. So, that heartbreak or this child knowing or realizing that this boy does not like her. She, she was not even feeling that, oh, nobody wants her, nobody loves her. At 11 years, she already feeling depressed. She already feeling not wanted. <sighs> so the mother was trying to encourage her, talk about it. Was also asking the other daughter. I don't know how many years is the other, whether nine years or eight years. Um, what about your crush? Do you still love your crush? She said, No, I have another crush. I have another person I love. I have another boyfriend. For me personally, I know sex education is something that I always say that. Start sex education at least from two years. You understand? Start talking to your child so that when somebody touch you here, let me know. You know, you understand. You know what sex education is all about. But when it comes to you are now comfortable discussing with your child about having a boyfriend to the extent he now get to like, how did this child get to know that, you know, how to understand that this is a heartbreak for her because the guy say, I don't want you. You know, that, how am I going to say it? To the extent she now knows that this is a heartbreak. She knows what is feeling depressed, feeling not wanted. Guys, this is one thing I don't like about divorce. Me, I'm not against divorce if maybe there is any reason like emotional abuse and all that, domestic, whatever. Or maybe you guys are not, you understand. But this is a big disadvantage about divorce. Because when two Couple are together. Okay, I'm not saying that they should come back together. Okay, I'm going to play the video. Then let me give my opinion. You are free to disagree with me. Okay. When one person, one single parent raising a child, there's so many gaps. I know these children sometimes they get to meet their father, stay two weeks or a week and come back like that. But it cannot still be like these two children. A lot of people, let me just say this, a lot of these people identify themselves as cats, rats different things 
Some will say, no, I don't feel like to poop in the toilet anymore because I feel I'm a cat. The other one, I did a video here, right? When a child decided to, to blind her two eyes because she feel I'm supposed to be born blind. People committing, you know, S-U-I-D. Committing this because they feel they are not loved. People are doing different crazy things because they feel they are not loved in the society at home or all this and that. People will tell somebody, you are not beautiful. That child will go and delete herself. A lot of crazy things are happening. There's even the one, a Nigeria child that jumped out from a tree. You understand? Um, you know, delete herself. Why? Because of the boyfriend said, I don't want you anymore. It's because of lack of love at home. It is high time we should, you know, we should be our children's best friend. Lily Peters is, let me say, she's trying, you understand? But she still has a lot to do, to talk at her child, her children, from all this feeling heartbreak as a child. It's crazy to me, okay? Because, I don't, I don't know, at 11 years, Jesus, why did I eat this virgin? Guys, okay. the whole thing is, it's too big for me, but I'm trying to cut it down because I'm going to play the video. I'm not just making this video just because of lip petals, but a lot of people, a lot of people are not loved at home. Do you know why a lot of things might happen on this social media? Maybe drama, saga, people drag me, or a lot of things happen. I do not shake me because I'm being loved at home. I like this kind of love I have for myself is to the extent that nothing shake me. Before I call myself, or people call me Ella the Unshakeable, Ella the Unmovable. Ah, I have seen 99, I talk of 100. But let's say I'm somebody who was not loved at home, and somebody just somewhere just lied against me. Something that never existed, that person just cut it from her own exist life and just put it on camera and said, Ah, it is finished for me. But the reason why it will make me stronger, no matter what, is because I have been loved at home. From the west, from the east, from the south. My husband, family. Hey, love, choke me. My own family, my siblings, my friends. I have, you understand? Personally, even without all these people, the kind of self-love I have for myself, it is unbeatable. So I want us all to develop that kind of self-love for ourselves. So that no matter what happens, we will not get depressed. So people will see some comments, they're already, they're already depressed. They're already feeling bitter because there's no peace with them. Now, when it comes to these children that God has given us, having a child is not just, oh, I want to be a mommy, I want to be a daddy. It comes with a lot of responsibility. Sometimes we cannot do it alone. We still pray that, God, God, please help me. Hey, God, please help me. Oh, I pray for wisdom. I pray for no. You still put in the hand of the same creator who gave you. Just last week, I had one of uh, Ghana, a child or a boy, deleted the father, the mother, and even the little sister over a little thing things like this happen so let me play the video for you guys you understand um if the mother can post that kind of video and have that kind of discussion who am i but i'm just giving my opinion just because it's really petals but for other people entirely just me you understand watch the video and tell me what you think so the other day yuri said all her friends have a boyfriend but she, yuri doesn't have one and yuri feels like no one loves her. There's no one loving her. <laughs> and I said, Yuri, don't worry. <laughs> don't worry, Yuri. You're, you're pretty much the, the prettiest girl at your school. Yeah, I mean, of course, to my eyes. <laughs> but Yuri, don't worry, okay? Huh? And then Yuri's crush just... Um... <laughs> Yuri's crush... As a girlfriend, so Yuri just found out about it. Well, but also you don't really know him. I guess that's what crush is about. You just like somebody that you don't really know much about. Anyway, Yuri. Huh? What I like someone else. He has a girlfriend. So you will like someone else? No. So, do you want to have a boyfriend? Hmm? You can tell me. That's okay. 
Right, oh, right, yeah, not on camera. No, yes, on camera. So that if anybody's interested in you, right. can, can say, hey, actually, Yuri, I have a crush on you in the comment section. I don't want to say so. That's from the internet. But you never know. The world is big, okay? Somebody who's in maybe like of Jamaica watching you right now and he's like, oh, I think you is cute. All right. He might be like 11 years old, just like you. And then one day you meet when you're like 18. <laughs> and then he's like, hey, do you remember the comment that I left <laughs> seven years ago? That was me. <laughs> anyway. Yuri, don't worry, okay? Don't worry. Are you popular, Yuri? Do girl, do yeah, do boys, do boys like you? At school? I don't know. Hola. Mi presento i miei. Yeah, e ora. Dash power pods, pulite impeccabili anche a freddo. I don't like the boys at my school. Yeah. <laughs> They literally have so much gel in their hair. <laughs> I know, they have way too too much gel in their hair. Like for picture and like, day? I know. Like, had so much gel in his hair and he was like this. His hair was like... Those boyfriend, girlfriend at your age, they don't last, okay? So wait. <laughs> wait for your turn. <laughs> he might be breaking up with his girlfriend after a month. Breath. <laughs> And then you and then you'll be his girlfriend and then after one month you break up and then, right. <laughs> then you go to the next one. <laughs> right. yeah, it's okay, Yuri. No, you don't need to worry about dating. Just worry about studying and then become the like amazing successful woman. And then you can choose whoever you want. <laughs> Once you get, you get money. Once you have money, you can choose whoever you want. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay, I'm actually. I'm in my class, and he doesn't believe I'm from Korea. Oh, really? Yeah. You just say you're from Korea. Yeah, I even spoke it to him, and he's like, "You're not convincing." <laughs> Told, There's you, no way. So you you told him that hey, I'm from Korea. I'm Korean. Yeah. 그렇게 말했어? Where are you from? And I was like Korean. And then he's like, You're not from Korea. And I'm like, Yes, I am. The funny thing is, um, the Sumi tells everybody that she's from Korea. Where everyone never believes her. Am I not from Korea? You are. <laughs> you are American and Korean. <laughs> what do you anyway. Think <laughs> She wants to marry someday when she's older. Is that right? Mm -hmm. Who do you want to marry? How? Let's see if it's all <laughs> What about, um, what was the Ezra? other guy? Ezra. Ezra yes. <laughs> you have a lot of words when you were younger. No, 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 no. You come back. I don't know. <laughs> what? We didn't have that discussion yet. <laughs> Do you like the Sumi? Well, yes. Well, we are friends also. Yes. <laughs> Wait, what did he say? Friends. <laughs> he just said friends. We are just friends. Girlfriends <laughs> and boyfriends is disgusting. <laughs> what? Disgusting? disgusting. Girlfriends <laughs> and boyfriends are disgusting. <laughs> Only friends are more better. Okay. Awesome. Good job. Do you like Ezra? No more? Mm -hmm. I actually still have um his mom's phone number. Really? I forgot to tell her that we I changed my phone number. Uh -oh. Yeah. Alright. So 
So don't worry, Yuri. I'm gonna let Amy be happy. I'm gonna let Amy get um, a boyfriend. What? But I'm gonna let Amy get a boyfriend. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I need to think about that. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna let you need to have a boyfriend. Uh, I would say fourteen or fifteen. But I don't know, maybe sixteen or maybe sixteen <laughs> or eighteen. <laughs> You're a dope, girl. Until then, just like play with them and just hang out with them, and yeah. But I don't know. Just when. You want to, I guess. We cannot really but all my friends control have boyfriends, you. Like when they were like ten. I cannot control you. I had my first boyfriend when I was let's see, what is it, love and break? How old are they? Sixteen? Yeah. Sixteen? Yeah. The first boyfriend. But I didn't really like him that much. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I just wanted to have a boyfriend because everybody has a boyfriend. Uh, yeah. It's like Peer pressure. Yeah. yeah. Like, I don't know. Because, like, whenever all your friends have boyfriends in high school, you're like, hmm, really? I should get one. <laughs> and they're like, oh, you so You can't join this group if you have a boyfriend. <laughs> I have my mom. I have my dad. <laughs> Mom, she loves me. <laughs> okay. Anyway. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Did you let her? Huh? Did you let her? She walk? She walk? Hi. Olinda. Probably in a month. And you probably already forget about him. Yeah. <laughs> in a month? Why? <laughs> I have a lot of other videos to upload. <laughs> I'm editing this video. So this this video was taken last fall. So it's been a while actually. I didn't upload it right away because obviously still. Well, tell me what you think. Do you support this kind of a thing? What do you think about this kind of video? Drop your opinion in the comment section. See you in my next video. My name is Ella Sutil.